Is it guys behind you? Does that give you, I don't know if motivation is the right word, but like the fact that someone's on your tail ready to take your spot? Sure, yeah, no, it definitely helps. And I, I mean, I'd say it's competition, but also it's kind of like helping out the younger guys, you know, like I won't be here for forever and someone's going to have to play offensive line when all of us old guys are gone. So it's almost like helping them out and getting them prepared to play someday, you know, so that's also definitely, I'd say that's more important to me than being in a competition with them is getting them ready to play. Are there any of those young guys who've really impressed you so far? Honestly, all of them have. I think Jano has a lot too. Yes, who Jano is, probably not. Yeah. Yeah, he's got a couple of firecracker, but uh, yeah, he's definitely been doing pretty good. What have been your impressions of working with Brent Soldier? He's definitely a really good guy. I mean, he'll, I don't even know, I don't know what time he gets here, but I mean, I'll be here like an hour and a half before the lift and he'll be already be here. I think he's already dressed. He's already got his uh, shoes on, you know, ready to go. He's just hanging out an hour and a half before the lift, ready to roll, you know, so he's definitely works hard. And I mean, yesterday I was driving my truck around and I seen him driving here. So I don't know what he was doing, maybe watching film or something, but he's so definitely working hard. What time about do you get that he's there before you? I mean, let's say I'm working out at 8, I'll roll up at, you know, 5, or let me do some math. Roll up here at 6.30 or so, you know, he's already got his shoes on, he's all dressed up, ready to roll. And, like, I don't have treatment or nothing, so I'm just here eating, but I don't know what he's doing. But he's here early, ready to roll, and that's what you want to see out of quarterback. How about Logan Jones? What should we expect from him this year? I think he's definitely improved a lot. Um, he's still pretty fast, unfortunately. Um, I mean, we work out together every day, you know, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, so spend a lot of time together. How's that competition between you two in the weight room? Who's got the, the you know, the records going up right now? I don't know. We haven't done a lot of heavy stuff right now. We're yeah. kind of doing more almost like speed work stuff. But, I mean, it's definitely a fun time to work out together. Um, you got beef days coming up. Your sure. title. Are you back? I don't think I'll be throwing this year. Just You're going to the Creed some concert? I had some shoulder work. No. I don't know. I don't even know he'd listen to Creed, but I guess he does. <laughs> I've never heard him play it. But <laughs> So, Jesse, you, you still don't own a television, right? No. Um, no. Oh, so, I'm living with Mason right now. So, we got one in the living room. But well, Do you use it? We actually watched a movie. Well, I read uh, Shawshank Redemption a couple days ago, and we finished it. So then we watched the movie last night. So you really you've never seen that? No, and I wanted to read the book first. Do you really love Stephen King? Uh, I was reading a little bit of it because I, I read a bunch of, uh, oh my gosh, what's his name? I'm going to sound like an idiot. Ernest Hemingway. I read like six of his books, and then I was like, I'll read some Stephen King too. So Give us some impressions of your uh, Hemingway. What uh, what stood out? What's uh, what's the book of his that you like? Cool Man in the Sea. I think that's a pretty good book. That's kind of one of his, I mean, that's the book that he won the, uh, was it the Pulitzer Prize for? Yes. Do, you, do you relate in some way, or what about it stood out to you? I mean, I like to fish, so I guess there's that. <laughs> <laughs> Besides reading, what else are you up to uh, this summer? Uh, fishing. I'm not taking a class. I'm trying to entertain myself. Working too, so. Working? What are you doing? I'm working in a research lab out in North Liberty. Oh, so, a research yeah. lab. Mm -hmm. Tell me about that. Uh, I just kind of do whatever they tell me to do, you know, whether it's helping clean up some of the, or coach some of the animals or, you know, do whatever, so. You know, I was going to say something about Brendan Sullivan coming here from Northwestern being a smart guy, but it sounds like you're a bit of an intellectual as well. Who, who wins if you guys go to a trivia night together? Probably him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just depends what we're doing trivia on. Yeah. <laughs> what have you seen from Kate since he's kind of been back? I mean, he's definitely been leading. He's ready to roll, you know. I mean, I talked to him every day, and I think he's ready to roll. It's going to be awesome watching him play. How excited are you? Well, you don't necessarily have to be excited because it's summer, but, like, how excited are you on a scale of 1 to 10 to, like, actually capture the field with your offensive line? I know you've been together for a long time, but now you're fully gelled with most of the seasons. I don't know. I mean, I wake up excited every day. You know, like, we're really fortunate to be able to play football, and it's even more fun to play with guys that you've grown up with and played a lot of ball with. And, I mean, I'm always excited, you know, so it's pretty awesome. How have you seen yourself uh, grow from the last play of the Citrus Bowl uh, to now? So I think one of the big things is, like, I went I went through and watched all the ball from last year, and I think some things I've been working on this spring are kind of, or I'm sorry, this summer, just working on, like, my feet and getting faster, and I dropped some weight, too, from fall because, you know, I was a little heavy, and the white jerseys did not look very good. But, <laughs> you know, so just work on that kind of stuff. You've been able to keep the keep the diet to where you want it. So what, what is the diet? Oh, last year it was carbs, then it was fruit, vegetables. Where are you at now? I mean, it kind of depends on the training day. I mean, today I was a little heavy because I carved up last night because we had a big workout today. But I mean, I was I woke up at three eleven on Monday, you know. So 
I don't know. It just kind of depends on the day, I guess. If we're working out the next day, I'll have some carbs at supper time and then eat a bunch of fruits and veggies, you know, during the day. So a lot of clement times. I love those things. Those little okay. <laughs> little, yeah. Can you, you those awesome. almond <laughs> I bet you could. <laughs> that place has everything. Is 311 your target or thereabouts? Yeah, somewhere around there, so. Do you feel quicker? Um, I think so. I don't know. I mean, I would hope so. I would Didn't think you, so. Barnett said you're up to like 350 last year. I was, yeah. I was uh, a little tubby. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could gain and drop weight like crazy fast. With, so, with all that cable, 